guys, we have to accept that there's some evil police officers. Mm. Remember, America's a big fucking country, you know. Imagine, let's just let's just pull a number and let's see. How, how many police officers do we think are actually active in America at this moment in time? Maybe a million police officers. So, of course, in that one million police officers, there's going to be some real bad, evil cops. Yeah? It shouldn't happen at all, but humans were a flawed species. Yeah? People are going to do the wrong thing. They take five cases out of 5,000 altercations with the police and make them tarnish all police with... With, with, with one brush. We're really interested. See, this is the thing that makes me laugh, eh? I just had an epiphany right now. Let's say black people, it's not even just black people, white people are jumping on jump, jump, jumping on the bandwagon as well, obviously, and other races. Yeah, everyone's against the police right now, aren't it? Yeah. But let's just use black people for an example, aren't it? Yeah? Black people are saying that all police are bad and tarnish all police with the same brush, yeah? Black people are basically saying that all police are bad. Yeah? A lot of them are saying that all police are bad. But these are the same people that don't like to get stereotyped. These are the same people that are pissed off when they get stopped and searched by the police because they look like people who are criminals. Yeah? So, for example, if I'm out on the street and I get stopped and searched by the police, if I get stopped and searched by the police, it's not because they necessarily think I'm a criminal per se, it's because I look like people who are criminals. I fit, I fit the same description as them, innit? Oh, the last five guys that we stopped that looked like me had something on them or they ran off or whatever, innit? So let's stop me. Funny enough, when I was walking, I went to my mum's house, when I was there last Thursday to Saturday, I was at my mum's yard, I was walking through my estate, one big blood clot uh, bully van went past. There was about 10 police officers. They drove past, and then they, they, they must have done a U-turn and went straight past. Now, I think they thought I was going to try and disappear or something like that. But once they saw that I just ignored them, then they just left me alone. Now, they was going to stop me. They was going to stop me. And I wouldn't be angry because I know there's man on my estate who's selling drugs. Yeah? There's man on my estate selling drugs. So I'm not blaming the police for that. I'm blaming the man them who is you know, coming from different areas, well, different parts of Edmonton or whatever, and licking their dots, whatever. They're making me look bad. They're making me look like a drug dealer. Because yeah? obviously I dress a certain way. And maybe I should dress differently if I don't want to get um, targeted by the police. But I dress a certain way. And they're basically tarnished me with the same brush. Yeah? Black people are doing it as well. They don't want to be tarnished with the same brush as criminals or whatever. But they're doing it to the police. They're making out that all police are bad. And it's just not the case. Not all black people are bad and not all police are, are bad. 